Hi, my name is Sarah Wolf, and I am the Associate Pastor at Covenant Presbyterian Church. Today I'm going to be reading Day 12 of The Best Gift Ever Given by Ronnie Martin. December 12th, God gave us hope. Our scripture passage is from Ruth chapter 4, verse 14. Blessed be the Lord who has not left you this day without a Redeemer, and may his name be renowned in Israel. There once was a girl named Ruth who had to leave her home and travel a long way to a place she'd never been before. Ruth was probably afraid, but she put her hope in God to help her. When Ruth arrived at her new home, she found a job working in the fields picking grain. God gave her enough grain every day so that she and her family had enough food to eat. God also gave Ruth a special friend named Boaz. Boaz was a very good man who owned a big field and let Ruth pick all the food her family needed. Ruth wasn't afraid anymore because God had helped her all along the way and given her hope. What does it mean to put your hope in God? It means believing God will do good things even when things around you seem very bad. Ruth put her hope in God because she believed he would take care of her even when she didn't know how he would. What do you think happened to Ruth and Boaz? They fell in love, got married, and had a baby. It was a very special baby too because their baby would someday become the father of King David. Hope is a wonderful gift from God, but his best gift ever is even better. What could it be? What is something you hope will happen? What does God want us to do when we are afraid of what might happen? Let's close with prayer. Dear God, even when we can't see what's going to happen, we can have hope in you. You will always work things out for good for those who love you and are called according to your purpose. Amen.